prepared to make this movie in a style that was work better with the material and in a, and in a Jim Cameron style, more grounded, so that you would believe the fantasy because it was so fantastical. It was such a deep sci-fi world far in the future. I needed it to be very relatable. No green screen. None of my old tricks. Really? Had to take things a little more seriously so that you would believe the world. And uh, then you can have the fun. So real sets, real locations, real actors around her, a real orange. Really going for realism more than I ever would on any of the fantasy type stuff that I do. Yeah, it looks a lot like the, the Dust till Dawn bar to me. <laughs> <laughs> you look close. Yeah, a really nice way of working. You know, he had this whole, he has a studio in his hometown and he built this whole city at his studio. And it's really like a family environment. So it was really nice, nice working with him. You still need proper nourishment for your brain. Mm. I know, do we have any chocolate? It's a specific mode. It's a very, it's a, it says a lot about him as a personality, as a director personality, that it is really his groove and you'd be silly not to really, with flying colors, join that groove. Nice work. Compliments to your crew. I finally get to experience, you know, working opposite of him as, as an actor and him obviously directing. And uh, I'm really happy with, with getting to collaborate with him. He's, he's got such a wonderful energy, very young energy. He's like a kid getting in there and excited to kind of tweak the scenes, and, and he can do everything. You know, it's pretty hard to sell this stuff. Shh, no. shh. Ah, Arita, the actor's person. Ah, so beautiful. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Yesterday, I took a take. I'll show you. 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 I hope they feel something. I haven't seen one of these big, epic, uh, you know, sci-fi movies that have moved me in a long time since, actually, Jim Cameron's films, since Robert Rodriguez's <laughs> films. You know, I haven't seen, I haven't felt something. I've seen big action pieces. I've seen, you know, crazy sequences that blow me away, but, but that's all left in the theater. Like, I, I don't go home and go like, wow, that, I don't think about that. I, I think about what it made me feel. I think about how I was changed by that experience. Um, and, and I hope people, moviegoers, walk out having felt something. That's why I tell stories. That's why I go see stories. So I really hope that they feel something. Good night and a picture wrap to our battle <laughs> angel herself, Rosa 